G'day guys, it's Remy here from Drive. Now today, we've got a really cool day to show you guys all about. We got Chris from Aussie Destinations Unknown. Now, everyone's gonna recognize Chris, mainly for that massive truck. <laughs> We're all gonna go through his system today, show you what it's all about. Now, we've also got Dan from Specialized Australia. Now, we've got Dan's demo van here. It's got a full Drive E system in it, powering the full Specialized demo fleet. Now, we're gonna go through that system as well, and it wouldn't be right if we didn't go out for a ride and really enjoy Daisy Hill and everything it's got to offer today. All right, guys, let's dive in. Right, guys, we're gonna dive in now with Dan and have a little look through the system. Dan, like, you know, we chatted about this for quite a while, trying to get this system right for you, but what, what were you doing beforehand? Like, how were you getting these bikes charged up and around all the events and everything? Yeah, so beforehand, the system that we ran was just a generator. So yep. we'd be pulling the generator out of the van for each event that we would yep. run. Um, that was great. It certainly did work, but it had its limitations. Yep. Um, the key limitation for me personally was the fact that after each event, we'd have the bikes that'd be dead, we'd need to charge them for the yep. next one. That run time and you're just waiting, trying to pack everything up. Yep. Yeah, so yep. after pack up, we'd be sitting around for an hour, two hours, even up to three hours if you had a big ride, yeah, right. just to make yep. sure everything was charged ready for the next event. Yep. So. Yep. That was the, the need of the solution, is the fact that we wanted to save that time, get the bikes in the van, get them charged, ready to go. Yeah, I mean, I can only imagine, you know, packing them up and then jumping on the road. You know, Dan's probably driving three, four hours between events at times. You know, some of the trips are from Cairns back to Queensland, you know, like it's a, it's a huge trip for him to go all the way from Cairns back to Brizzy and whatnot to home base. So I, that's gonna make a huge difference for you guys, just, you know, time-wise. But what about the other niceties? Have you got anything new in the van now? Like, Oh, it was incredible. And the fact that we could put the Dometic fridge in there, we got a coffee machine in there nice. as well. So so all the on-the-road pleasantries means that I can drive, be comfortable and be happy, eat yeah. the food that I want to eat and... You're not stopping for, you know, fast food or things we, you know, shouldn't really be eating a lot of and, you know, now you, you can live that sort of a healthier lifestyle, you know, keep yourself fueled for the guided rides and whatnot while you're out there. Yeah, exactly yeah. that. Dan, thanks, thanks so much for your time, mate. Like, thank you so much for giving us the opportunity to, to get this system up and running for you and let you, you know, get out there and do your job a lot more efficiently, so. No, yeah. thank, thank you. Thanks for getting everything going and getting me on the road. Yeah, it's, no. it's significantly better. Now, obviously, this is what I do for work, yeah. and it, it certainly helped me out on a work basis, but oh, totally. yeah. there is a truck right here that looks like it's built for fun. Oh, mate, um, absolutely. Could, we'll, um, yeah. could you show me through that one and yeah, see we'll, what it's we'll, got? We'll get Chris in in a minute, and uh, yeah, we'll go through the whole truck and show you what it's all about, go through Aussie Destinations Unknown's new build. All right, guys, we've got Chris here from Aussie Destinations Unknown. Now, you know, we don't need to introduce Chris. He's been with us forever. Yeah. You've got a system in your truck, you've got a system in your van, and yeah. we've got the new truck, you know? Just be honest, is this bigger than the last one, mate? Of course it is, mate. You've got to go bigger and bad every right? time, yeah, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> and of course, you've got the e-bikes, right? So yes. you guys have got the Specialized Levos, the yep. new ones. So yep. you're out riding, um, you know, pretty much every day or so. Absolutely, yeah. I yeah. mean, there's places and times where we've, there's no trails, so it yep. yep. um, gets a little bit hard, but having an e-bike, mate, oh, it's just, yeah. makes when you, it so much better. The when, fitness goes down oh, you know, totally. when you're not riding. Absolutely, so, yeah. yeah. And you've got yeah. to get out there and enjoy the time where you can, because yeah, obviously yep. you can't take the van everywhere. You know, no. you can get it in most places, but some yep. of the trails are pretty inaccessible. So, yep, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. So yeah. this is why having the system in here and being able to charge it on the go, it's just been unreal no for you brainer guys. For yeah. Us, yeah. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Do you yeah. want to run us through the system? What do you got in here? Yeah, what's, absolutely. What's the new one? Mate, we're running 400 amps of lithium in here. Yep. Um, we got 300 watts of solar on the roof, which is yep. cool. Keeps yep. the charge all the time with the fridge running, so don't yep. have to really worry about that. Um, we're running the new prototype. Am I allowed to say it, mate? You can say it. You can say it. So we've got, the, we've got a new 3,000 uh, 100 amp hour inverter charger, which yep. is one of the new units for us. Um, so Chris is actually doing a bit of testing on it for us, which is awesome. So yep. we're getting a bit of feedback from him, a bit of changes and things like that that we'll incorporate with the new model. So yep. it's going to be really good. Oh, yeah. Awesome. And then obviously running with that, we've got the two DCs, yep. twin DCs this time. Yeah, because so. obviously you've got a big enough alternator in the truck yeah, to support it. So. Yeah, massive. Yeah. Alternator yeah. in these things, mate. Yeah. yeah, so it's awesome system. This looks after itself. Yeah, it really does. Yeah, yeah. no, unreal. Yeah. Well, mate, we might um, we might duck around and sort of get a bit of a better look over it and sort of show the guys what it's all about and show them a bit more of the build. Sounds good, mate. Yeah, Sounds yeah. good. Awesome. Right, guys, we're at the, uh, what you class as the, the business side of this canopy. So where Chris and Miriam are going to spend most of their time. Uh -uh. No, no, just me. Oh, sorry, mate. Miriam's yes. in the caravan. Come yeah. on. This is this is my safe spot. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to give us a run through? Show us what this side of it's all about? Yeah, like, sure thing. This there? is um, uh, Cy Marine. So this will yep. obviously show us everything that's going on. Charge coming in, charge coming out. I see there's an extra little bit attached there. Mate. I you do, wanna, mate. You tell us what's going on so there? So that's the new switching component of it all. So we can switch lights. Lights on. Yeah, everything. We've got lights either side. We've got fridge. We've got water pump. 
we got accessories, we got power up to the rooftop tent. How have you found it so far? Are you really stoked with it? Like, oh, yeah. It's great. Amazing, right? amazing, yeah, yeah absolutely. Awesome. So obviously in the last truck we didn't have the switching, so we'd yeah. have to have a totally separate switch component, which was a pain in the bum, mate, so this is oh, awesome. Absolutely. Then we've got the big inverter switch, which is, is pretty much on all the time, mate. We've got all camera gear charging yeah. pretty much 24-7 yeah. on the other side. So For you guys, you're, you're fairly large power consumers, like realistically, we do, yes. you use quite a lot. Yeah. So um, definitely, you know, especially charging the camera gear and then obviously the e-bike batteries, everything else, you know, you've got to try and 100%. keep everything topped up. But, yeah. Yeah. So you got your, your fridge and yeah. um, what's, what's going on the rest of this? Uh, side, mate? mate, we have double induction in here. So this is the cooktop. Yep, nice. So double induction. And then up here we have a large convection microwave, air fryer, sort of everything in one. So, yeah, right. so that's that's power hungry, this thing. So oh, having absolutely. the 400 amps yep. to run it all and then the twin DCs when we start the car up again is, yep. is absolutely amazing. Again. Really nice storage as well. Like yeah, amazing. on this side. Yep. Yeah, that's awesome. No, it's, they've, done, they've done really well with it, mate. But, yep. but yeah, induction all the way. We, we haven't used gas in a long time. There's nice. definitely no need for it anymore. And you don't have issues obviously with the wind and everything with these as well. Which that's is the just, great just part about so induction. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And our caravan is the same thing as well. Yeah. So so just yeah. all induction. We have no gas on the on the on the, on the caravan. So unreal. Yeah, yeah. it's a game changer, and it? it really is. It totally changes yeah. the way you can travel too. Oh, know, absolutely. You're not, you're yep. not planning a trip around. Oh, I'm about to run out of gas. Yep. I need to find some more and yep. whatnot. So. And funny enough, gas is getting harder and harder to get. It's almost in remote a areas. Strange commodity nowadays. Yeah, it hey? is. Yeah. 100 percent it is, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. Well, we'll duck on the other side and sort of yep. see the uh, the power side of things. Sure thing. Go through it all. Let's do it. All right, guys. So we're on the uh, we're on the power side of this system. So, um, Chris, you want to take us through a little bit? Of what looks you've got great. It, it looks it? unreal. How cool! Yeah. Do you like the lights and stuff on it's it as awesome, well? It's awesome because we designed this obviously with um, Off Road Creative, right? Yes, yeah, yes, so, yeah. So this was incorporated with them guys. Um, as you can see here in the window, we've got the twin DCs, yep. which yep. is really cool. Yeah. Um, that's the new MPPT solar controller. Yep. Which is great. Um, in here, mate, that's more the business side. That's more your technical side, isn't it? Yeah. So you've got the new um, the SPDU fifty two unit, which is the yep. new Cymarine uh, digital switching uh, yep. unit, which is also part of the uh, the panel on the other side that we saw with all the the digital switch panel on that side too. So really nifty bit of kit for us. Game been changer. Really cool. Yeah. 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Awesome. Yep. And then we have got obviously all the storage side here. In this drawer here, we have. All my stuff that's charging permanently. Unreal. permanently. Got, all the Makita batteries, we got heaps of stuff. Drones, we got all the cameras, we got GoPros, we got yep. sat phone, mate, we've got absolutely everything charging. And obviously that's in. all running off the new three thousand um, inverter mate, it charger. Is. Yeah. Yeah, like so. I said, so that inverter's on permanently. Yeah. yeah. Everything is always topped up. Being content creators, mate, we've got to have the charge all the yeah. time. So yeah. yeah, it's really cool. Been awesome for you guys so far, hey? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. 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 Not having it not having to think about it is 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 unreal, yeah. you know. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely brilliant. Yeah. Awesome, guys. Well, thanks a lot for uh, for coming through it all. We're, uh, we're going to go jump on the bikes in a minute. Um, if this is something that you're interested in, um, if you're an OEM and you're watching this video and going, that's something that I want in my canopy designs, give us a call. We're more than happy to help you out and design something up for you guys, specific for your needs. But yeah, let's, let's go, go jump on the bikes, dirt, mate. Eh? Yeah, let's go enjoy ourselves. <laughs> guys thanks a lot for watching the video coming out sort of seeing what we've done today you know we've had this awesome opportunity to sort of have a look at Aussie Destinations Unknown's new truck and then of course the specialized demo van and all the amazing stuff that we've got there the bikes absolutely unreal um, as always if you've not ridden an e-bike you need to go out there and really get on one experience it it's something else it's not like riding anything else um, as always, anything Anadrive related, you can find it on our website, social media. Um, if you've got any questions, always give us a call. We're more than happy to help. Dan, as, as always, thanks a lot, mate. Yeah. Th thank you so much for coming out. Thank you for riding these bikes. And of course, thank you for the amazing setup that's sitting in that van. Yeah. It means I can take these bikes home and get them charged and ready to go for the next event without too much thought. Yeah. Obviously, if you want to test ride one of these bikes, please head to either specialized.com or your local retailer so you can check out where not only these bikes are available, but where the test, test fleet is as well. So. Don't forget to head there and thanks for showing me the big truck as well. No, mate, you're more than welcome. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a great day.